What's up everybody? Welcome to this very brief um, video about an iMac. Now, the issue with this iMac is that it was giving me um, a scattered display, lines on the display, and I could virtually not work with it because it would freeze most of the time. So what I did is, of course, I opened it up. I took off the fr front panel um, and went into the interior. During that process, I managed to conveniently damage it so basically it does not work with the with the uh, uh, its normal uh, screen display so that's why I'm using a monitor to work with it but the issue I want to talk about is how did I get um, past the issue of the scattered display with the which is of course the video card to get it to work through the external monitor now all I did that is I removed the graphics card which is this guy um, and I I applied some heat with a blowgun to it for about two minutes and then I put it back in and it worked so this is the second time I've done it I'm not saying this is the solution to it but it will get you by until you manage to get yourself a new iMac or whatever you your plan is so all I'm saying is that um, there's a quick um, way to to try to um, restore your data and make sure you get everything you want before you discard your iMac if it's got a scattered display and that's by taking off the front panel and the display um, and the LCD um, panel and then uh, removing the graphics card which is pretty easy to remove remove all these screws pull it out and then you apply some heat to it now you could damage your, your iMac like I'm saying this one does not work with the monitor anymore because this part where the cable for the LCD goes doesn't um, is broken and also this part I broke off part of that so it is a very delicate pr procedure I encourage you to watch a couple of YouTube videos before you actually do this the second thing I want to talk about is um. As you can see, it's going quieter now. So what's going on here is uh, because um, the, I'm using software to control my fans and this is called Fan Control, Max Fan Control. I think it does come with a couple of viruses, so you've got to have a good antivirus on your system to make sure that your system doesn't get infected. But as you can see, it's um, quieting down my system. If you want to see how it works, let me just turn it off press that and off it goes so the fan is going now so if I click automatic it will go to its own settings but I, I want custom settings so um, revs 2800 let's turn that down to 2400 but I want it sensor based so that um, if it reaches 20 uh, degrees the fan will go on now you will see that it will slowly go quiet there we go so uh thank you very much for watching I, I just wanted to highlight where the graphics card is the danger of removing it yourself and the results of what you could get when you do remove it right, i hope you enjoyed this video and i uh, hope to catch you in the next one please leave comments below on what you, you have done to to have a workaround if you have a scattered display on your imac and also um how you did it. Thank you. Bye.